Yankee, you're the author of Fire in the Belly, which is a classic. In March, you are going to talk with Bob and Brody about entrepreneurship. Tell me a little bit about Fire in the Belly. Okay. Um, very happily, I've just published the 10th anniversary um, edition of Fire in the Belly. Fire in the Belly is not about how to start your own business. There are lots of other uh, books around that do that and do that very well. Fire in the Belly is about why. Why should you? Why would you? Are you fit for it? And really the main uh, message of Fire in the Belly is can you make the emotional switch from the employee mindset where everyone starts? We all start life, adult life, as employees in order to become um, a self-employed person, a non-employee. Um, I've created the term recovering employee, which, which always raises a chuckle because everyone who starts a business is by definition a recovering employee. And in the same way that recovering um, has connotations of there's something you need to detox, there's something you need to deprogram, you've got to unlearn. There's a huge amount that we have to unlearn in order to start our own business, mainly because the school system, the educational system, school, university, whatever, is geared 99.9% .9 at producing good employees. So if we want to break out of that, at any age and at any stage of our lives, we've got to, we've got to ditch all that conditioning. And fire in the belly, as the name suggests, you've got to bring passion huge belief in yourself, you've got to enjoy what you're doing, and if you can't bring passion and energy and fire in the belly to a new business, my advice would be stay with the day job, because no one can guarantee that any new business is going to survive, and we know that the survival rate isn't terribly high, which doesn't put people off from trying. I can guarantee that unless you've got fire in the belly, your chances are even worse with fire in the belly, with determination, with belief in yourself, and with a total jettisoning of the old mindset and taking on the new mindset, I truly believe your starting position when you start your own business is in the right place.